So here's a really quick demo of our new uh, reset boundary conditions. So what a reset uh, boundary condition does is as, uh, as we have these objects um, passing through the domain and they, will, they can carry a chemical species um, cargo that are attached to them, if they cross a periodic boundary with the reset attribute set, that causes um, any boundary crossings to reset their chemical species to uh, whatever is defined as their um, initial value. So they can run this, and because I have a flux turn here, as this object passes that one, um, the flux becomes active. Then I go ahead and make a couple objects here, set their initial values, and I just go ahead and put a little key press handler there so I can reset the values like so, and so, okay. So as you can see, as the object passes through, its um, species gets reset. This is uh, designed so that um, when we're writing a model with a uh, different kinds of chemical um, sources in there, and as these particles carry cargo through there, um, as they pass through there, uh, effectively, new um, fresh objects enter with no attached cargo. So that, that allows us to write um, um, certain kinds of models where we have, say, a streaming sources, and we want to look at um, how uh, diffusion off of a source um, behaves downstream. So really simple. And that's literally the entire model right here.